Okay, this is part two of the radio unlock. This is the second radio. And no matter what combination, they were like saying 2-4 and all these buttons to press. But the problem is if that has an RDS in it, it can't be unlocked with those secret codes. It has to be take either the chip out, but this time we're going to try to just clip number 8 wire on the chip and put this back in see if it'll unlock the uh, thing so that's what we're gonna do I'm gonna take it out try to clip number eight all right just take the two screws out here pop the top off and inside here there's only one that looks like this which is this one and it's that pin right there that we're going that's number eight there you go we are going to remove that one that should be number eight well I think I got it off not sure I'm gonna go try it see if it works Okay, so that looks like it worked. I just scraped that little leg off number eight. And uh, what I don't know is if it'll keep a memory. So uh, let's program this channel. This is 97, so we'll program that channel two. Uh, we'll go turn it off a few minutes and uh, See if 92, that was weird. I don't know what that was all about. Some sort of phone number. Oh, that's the name of the song. Uh, let's see if it'll... I don't even know what time it is, but... Uh, well, I'm using my phone. I don't know what time it is. But anyway, we'll turn it off. See if that uh, saves a memory. The last one didn't save a memory. As uh, far as I'm concerned, it probably works. So I'm going to go ahead and batten this right up while I'm doing that. Here's I wanted to take that out. None of the controls worked. The speakers crinkled. So some of these connections got to be not very good. And so I just wanted to put a factory one back in there to make everything work. This was 200 bucks worth of stuff. So maybe we'll put that in one of our other cars. 